We've got some awards to give. All the way from Cincinnati, Ohio, ABC Blake. Come on up here, Lisa. Lisa, welcome to Art Expo New York 2018. Thank you very much. I'm happy to be here again. Yeah. And Sylvia, this is not your first show. You've been to many art expos. It is not my first show, but it's my best show. I was looking at the collection of work, and I mean, obviously, you've been to many art expos, but I was looking at the collection of work, and honestly, I would say that this is by far the most diverse collection that you've ever brought to any of the shows. What, I mean, and you are, you're a person, Lisa, that's very conscious of trends. You, you pick up trends of color, you pick up trends of style, uh, direction of art, and so forth. What is it that you're seeing in the last two or three years as far as a trend of art that's made you respond in the way that you're responding? So um, it's very important that you understand what's happening out there in the design industry. And so uh, when you say trending, that's a very, very important word. Um, what's trending now, what everyone seems to be buying, a lot of our clients, uh, we know this, love color. They want art that um, shows energy, that makes them happy, that is large, a lot of large scale artwork. Um, so bring, uh, that's what we were thinking when we came here, to bring artwork that build uh, that type of trend that's happening now. Well, and uh, one of the things that as a gallerist that um, I look uh, for in terms of trends is that people are really looking and excited about the idea of different kinds of mediums. It's not uh, just about paintings and it's not just about sculptures. It's about the amalgamation of all of those things and creating new types of expressions. So that's what I look for. And I think that's what the people that are here are looking for, new and exciting things to make art new and fresh for them. I, I would tell you, and this is again an observation about your collection, uh, we don't have a lot of pieces that move here, but we see movement in what seems to be in all of the artwork. There seems to be movement in the artwork. Have you noticed that or is that something that I've just picked up? I've noticed it. Yeah. Like some of the uh, holographic yeah. uh, works, those are fascinating. Yeah. Even our artist, Ken Rush, who does the metal, he grinds into it and it feels like it's moving. So people are fascinated by that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, you know, obviously we're seeing very strong color contrast in sculpture. We're seeing strong color contrast in 2D work. We're seeing, you know, in this, as an example, in the copper, we're seeing a raised relief from the wall. All of these things create dimensional depth, color, uh, Again, movement. I mean, I, 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 you just see movement. You see it in the sculpture. You see it in those pieces. You see it in the copper. You see it in the work behind us. It seems as though there's movement in so many things. Absolutely. Congratulations on the great show. Thrilled to have you here. Yeah, Sylvia.